Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is pretty early right now, so I do apologize that I look half asleep. It's probably because I am. <laughs> my hair's just drying naturally, so just ignore everything that's going on right now. But today I'm actually going to be bringing to you guys 25, if that's right, I think there's 25, very cheap stocking filler ideas, but for girls. So I've got my little stock in there, are a few little goodies inside here, um, but there's other stuff just down here because they don't all fit, obviously. But yeah, so I'm hopefully gonna go through 25 stocking ideas that are actually under, I think they're all under five pounds, I believe. So if you are struggling for ideas for potentially a sister, friend, girlfriend, anybody here is just a quick guide of some little bits that you can actually get for quite a cheap price okay so I'm gonna go inside my little stocking and see what I pull out first I've actually raved about these quite a lot in a few of my videos but it is just the body shop little hand creams but the body shop do these little hand creams and they're actually very very good I have been raving about these recently but they've got well I've got a pink grapefruit one here but they actually also have a little Christmas range so they've got vanilla chai they've got a frosted berries one and they have a frosted plum one and they actually have an offer on these I'm pretty sure I think they're like three for two and these are only five pounds each so if you buy three you're only spending ten pounds you get three you could put one in one stocking one in another and one in another so they're maximum like five pound each so I think that these are a great little stocking filler so makeup is always a brilliant thing to receive at Christmas especially for those girls who are very into their beauty and their makeup and it's something that I think is an incredible stocking filler is actually eyeshadow palettes the makeup revolution ones are incredible quality and look the right way around and look at how many colors you get these palettes are only four pounds each so I think these are incredible how many shades do we get you get 12 shades in these palettes they do a few different types of them a few ranges of different shades and like I said they're only four pound and I think these are absolutely brilliant so I would recommend checking out makeup revolution because they have some incredible pieces for very very cheap and I don't see anyone complaining about these so these are only four pound they're a great stocking filler so another stocking filler that you could actually use is actually lipsticks there are a lot of makeup brands out there that do lipsticks for so so cheap it is unreal you can obviously check out the Primark ones as well they're very cheap but I've got a couple here so I've got the MUA ones these are only a pound each they do have incredible ranges but this is what I'm wearing today it is just a red lip and these are a pound the formula is amazing you can't go wrong with a pound so you could grab maybe a few more of these and put them all in the stocking fillers and Freedom also have little lipstick boxes I think this is the vamp collection they came in just a little box and they were five pound for five lipsticks so it's basically a pound each so you can either give someone the entire box as a stocking filler or you could actually open them up and share them out between different stockings so that is another little trick or tip when it comes to stocking fillers I would definitely recommend lipsticks another stocking filler that I always love to receive is actually nail varnish I do love painting my nails all the time the Barry M nail paints are very very good quality and I think these are maybe 3 dollars but boots do always have three for two offers on and so does Superdrug so you can always get a few for a little offer but these are brilliant there are so many different shades perfect for Christmas but also perfect for all year round so nail varnishes the tiny they go straight into a stocking but they are a great little gift so that's another stocking filler for you so another little idea for a stocking filler is actually toiletries I know one of the best things that I always get every single year is soap and glory products you just can't go wrong I think most girls actually get some form of soap and glory product every year Year, but this is just one I received last year and obviously this was not under five pound but you can get these individually but also a little cheeky trick you can use you can buy the sets because it works out cheaper and then you could use each individual item in there as a stocking filler so you've got the loofah but you can get the miniature products like this so this is the clean on me shower gel the hand food I held that really wrong hand food so the scrub of your life mini the righteous butter oh it smells amazing see like I said I got these last year and I still haven't used these because of how many soap and glory products I actually get <laughs> but like I said you can get those individually and because they are so small and so cute they're like the travel size ones you can use them to pop inside a stocking but I think that is a great idea you can buy the entire gifts and then 
share them out or you can buy them just as they are the little miniatures. So that's another little stocking filler idea, toiletries, but I would always recommend the Soap and Glory ones. You can get other branded toiletries, obviously, but that's just one of my favourites, so that's a little idea for you. So if you are planning on getting a stocking and completely filling it, but you don't want to spend too much, I would recommend hair tools. So for example, you can maybe get a back combing brush, or you can get these really cool little packets of clips from Primark, which comes in a really handy little box. Or you could get bobbles, anything like that, maybe just a mixture of them and tie a little bow around them. They are not expensive at all. You can get them from Primark, um, Body Care, H&M, Asda, Tesco, supermarkets. You can get things like that from absolutely anywhere. And girls always need hair products. We always need clips because we lose clips all the time. We lose bobbles all the time. So I think that would be a very good stocking filler. Dive back into my little stocking. Oh, okay. So the next one is actually candles. You can get candles for very, very cheap. If you are a girl out like there like me, I adore candles. I love having so many of them lit and you don't always have to spend a lot of money on them. You can obviously get more expensive candles, but you can get candles for dirt cheap everywhere else. So for example, same again, Primark does some extremely cheap, cheap candles. Home Sense do cheap ones. You can get them all for under a fiver but something I like for stocking filler wise because they're small is actually the mini Yankee candle one so this is Christmas garlands and it's just one of them is it a votive I think these are called I'm not too sure just the little ones these smell so Christmassy and I think these are like £1.49 maybe but you can get them in maybe B&M or places like that for a pound or so so those are great stocking filler and similar to obviously the candles is actually the wax melts you don't obviously have to get branded wax melts but I do prefer the Yankee candle ones you can get these in sets or individually again they're like what a pound max two pound so I've just got a few here this is holiday magic then this is oh this is actually a different brand this is heart and home Christmas tree wax melt and then I've got the sugared apple from Yankee and the candy cane forest and these are great even if you get someone a bigger present and get them an actual wax melter you could then use these as stocking fillers or if you know someone has a wax melter these are always a great little gift this isn't always relatable to every single person you're buying for but a lot of people do like to read so if you know that this person likes to read then you could always get them books you can get books for so so cheap from loads of different places. You can get them from charity shops where they're pretty much brand new. You can also get them from places like Asda and Tesco. I'm not too sure if it is Asda or Tesco, but one of them does a two for seven pound deal on pretty much all of their books. So even though that goes over the five pound mark, that's £3.50 a book, so you can get two people a little stocking filler. Loads of places do it. The works do them. You can get three for a fiver, which is so, so cheap. So I always think books are a great little gift to pop inside a stocking for someone. Another stocking filler is actually notebooks or a diary. So I've just got a few examples here. I got this incredible one from Primark. I think it was like, what? two pound then I've got these two which actually came in a set I think these were from the pound shop or pound world and I got both of them and um, no sorry this one was in a pack of the same so two of these and two of these and the they were like a pound each for a pack of two so I think those are gorgeous but similar to a notebook you could also get someone a diary for the next year this is a academic one but you can get normal diaries you don't have to spend a fortune on these you can pay a pound in the pound shop or a couple pound in B&M you don't have to pay out your ass for these and I think notebooks always come in handy stationery in general always comes in handy and that you can get them for so cheap so I would recommend getting these as a little stocking filler not everyone does love stationery but I know a lot of people do and um, but you can always always grab someone some really cute pens or pencils if you know they're going to use them like me I love drawing I love my art so I've got a range of cute pencils from Primark um, and B&M you can get some really cool pastel pens so I just think they are another great um, stocking filler to actually receive but they're not expensive whatsoever but yeah I just think pens and pencils are a great thing that you can pop in there another stocking filler idea is actually key rings you might just think who's gonna want a keyring but you would be very surprised we all seem to own loads and loads of keyrings but when it actually comes to needing one for some new keys you just can't find them anywhere so you can get really cute cheap ones from places like H&M Primark Forever 21 the big fluffy pom-poms always go down well but yeah you can grab someone a pom-pom or a 
cute little keyring, an initial keyring for a couple of pound, one pound in general, and they are very cheap, but they always come in handy. And I've never received a keyring and gone, oh, I've always been like, oh, that's really cute. I will definitely use that. So that is another idea that you could use. So something that I actually get my sisters every single year is actually a pair of fluffy socks. These are just the ones from Primark. You get two for one pound eighty. There are so many patterns, so many different types, and they're one pound eighty. They're super cute. They're super soft. They keep your feet warm for at Christmas, and I just think they're great. They can pop right into your stocking. They don't cost too much, but everyone needs a pair of fluffy socks over Christmas just to keep their feet warm. So that is another little thing that you can pick up. This one kind of falls under the same category, but it is actually three different items, and that is a hat, a scarf, and a pair of gloves. So you can get hat, scarves, and gloves for so so cheap, but they look so cute. So for example, Primark have incredible little bobble hats for £4 ish and they've got loads of different types. I recently picked up this super soft grey scarf from Primark. This was only £4 I believe. You can also grab gloves for maybe like two packs like £1 something and it is cold, it's Christmas, everybody needs a hat to chuck on, a scarf to keep them warm and a pair of gloves. So that is a really good idea. I know H&M, Forever 21. There are so many different places you can get them from and you can get loads of different designs for very, very cheap. And they do roll up or they do come quite small so they can pop inside a little stocking. So that is another little idea for you there. Something else that you might think is a little bit of a cop out, but if you're like me, you like to be greedy around the Christmas time and eat as much chocolate and sweets as you can, then I always love receiving chocolates and sweets inside a stocking filler. For example, my mum's favourite um, favorite like sweets is the Thornton's Special Toffee. I got these from like home bargains for maybe like a pound, so I'm gonna pop those in a stocking for her. And she also loves these natural jelly snakes. She adores these, so I'm just gonna pop them in as well. But you can get chocolate and sweets for so, so cheap, B&M, home bargains, pound shop, and you can get massive packs for a pound and you can share them out between different stockings which I think is another great idea to just fill up them stockings and make it look like you've put a lot more effort in when you know you probably haven't. <laughs> another thing that I would always recommend getting someone is maybe beauty tools so if you can find a little cheap packet of makeup brushes you could always pop them in there or you could get someone things like eyebrow tweezers or a nail file or spoolies anything like that you can find beauty products for so so cheap in places like body care, Primark again, um, as to test go normal supermarkets you can find super cheap little tools like that that always come in handy that you always need lying around that you can just grab don't have to spend too much money on them and you know that they are 100% going to get used so I would definitely recommend maybe grabbing someone something like that another great stocking filler if you've seen some of my previous videos you would have seen these but it's actually mugs you can get mugs for so so cheap it is unreal this one was 1.99 from BNM and this one was a pound from the pound world you can get some really 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 cute mugs for people I not everyone drinks hot drinks but they are great for people you know who drink tea coffee hot chocolates anything like that but you don't even have to buy a patterned one already you can actually DIY these which is just that extra bit of a touch you can get the plain ones from Ikea for maybe like 90p and sharpie them yourself or DIY them themselves and then you can pop little goodies inside there as like an extra treat another idea for you guys is actually a phone case the majority of people these days have phones we know that we are a generation that relies on our phones and you can get some super cute phone cases from pretty much everywhere and anywhere but you don't have to spend a lot of money on them I know that I have one on my phone currently from skinny dip which is maybe like 12 or 13 pounds so if you would like to spend a little bit more money you can get them more higher price phone cases but you can get them off eBay for 99p Amazon Again, Primark, look everywhere because most places actually do phone cases now, even things like clothes shops, they do have a little accessory bit where you can get phone cases from. I know H&M do them for cheap as well. So if you know someone is in need of a new phone case or if you know that someone's actually asked for a new phone for Christmas, you could maybe get them a phone case to go along with that. So that is a, another little idea for you. So kind of going off what I said before and you can grab a few little makeup bits, you can also get someone a super cute makeup bag. I know this one is like extra as hell, but you can pick makeup bags up again from Primark, H&M, Penworld, Forever 21. 
anywhere you know on the high street that is going to do super ch super cheap ones like new look you can get them for a few pounds you don't have to spend over a fiver on them and I think a good idea I have done this before is getting someone a makeup bag and then wrapping up little makeup bits like I said the hair tools the beauty tools and popping them inside so they'll be like oh I've got a gorgeous makeup bag thank you so much and then they'll open it and they'll have more goodies inside which is another cute little idea so yeah makeup bags are always a good thing for a makeup lover hair lover anything like that so another idea it might sound a bit daft and especially because not everybody does fake tan but when it comes to the festive season there are a lot of parties going on I like to look um, tanned especially and we can't really get a summer glow when it's winter so fake tan is always a good little gift you can pop inside there this is a super super cheap brand but I swear by this this is the St Moritz one you can get this from a lot of places home bargains B&M body shop and their no sorry body care they're so so cheap I think I paid maybe two pound three pound for this and this will do me throughout my entire winter season party season so I think that is a great little stocking filler as well but obviously only if they fake tan there's no point in getting fake tan for people who don't fake tan because they'd be like thanks you tell me I'm pale cheers another idea is actually a purse I have had this one now for probably over a year this one again was from Primark as you can tell I bloody love that shop and again it is extra as hell I think this was maybe be what £1.50, £2.50 max and it has lasted me so much. This gets absolutely battered and it is still in a pristine condition. So you can grab bigger ones, obviously this one is huge, you can get smaller ones from Primark, H&M, Forever 21, um, New Look, Top shop, you can get them from absolutely everywhere. But if you want a cheap one for less than a fiver, you can hit those more budget shops up and you can always grab someone a super cute purse. And if you're feeling a little bit extra, you can put a gift card in there. But that is actually everything. Those are just a few little stocking filler gift ideas that you can use if you are struggling a little bit this year to come up with a few ideas. Personally, I like to get people loads of little gifts instead of spending loads of money on one thing because I personally love opening loads of little bits and I think it is a great idea to get someone a big stocking and just fill it with loads of goodies so there are just a few little ideas that you can actually use if you are wondering what to get someone this year I will actually be doing a stocking filler gift ideas for him obviously this was the her one I will be doing one for him so if you are wondering what to get someone in your life like your dad brother boyfriend anyone like that then stay tuned because that one will be coming next but that is everything today if you have your own stocking filler ideas feel free to leave them down below it would be great to see some more but thank Thank you so much for watching today guys I hope that you enjoyed it please give it a massive thumbs up leave me a comment down below and if you're not I would appreciate it if you would hit the big red subscribe button that would be great and I will see you in my next one bye